We're here with Johnny Mertz, a winning trainer of the Paddy Power Madrid Handicap and it must be brilliant just to just get off the mark in the first day of the turf season. It's been a long winter, we haven't had many runners over the Dundalk over the winter. By design we, we, we plan to start the flat season well so yeah it's great. It's, you're coming here, you're excited, you're wondering where your horses are but uh, we had a few horses ran well today, they seem to be fit enough so a bit of a surprise but coming here, she, she had been working well at home but coming here and winning the Madrid handicap is, um, yeah, it's it's special. And could we see her back here again? I mean, what, what kind of path does that lay out for her ah, on? There's loads of nice fillies races, fillies handicaps for her during the year. So there's a, there's a nice one here coming up in a couple of weeks time again. Um, I see her as a handicapper at the moment and hopefully she can improve and maybe pick up a bit of black type along the way. But very genuine, uh, six or seven furlongs seems to be okay for her. Um, and I'm delighted for my wife because she owns her. <laughs> good stuff, so all, all good at home then. All good at home. Um, can't leave you without mentioning Sean Brazilese, a brilliant filly last year. How is she and when are we likely to see her again? Yeah, she's going very well. Um, there's a couple of races there. We have um, the Gladness Stakes or the Atezi Stakes uh, for, penciled in for her. We haven't been doing too much. She's cantering up the grass at the moment. We're just tipping her along nicely. Um, but we'll be aiming her at all the big mile races during the season. Um, so we're very excited, new owner in the yard and we're very excited to get her back this year. And I suppose overall Johnny, I mean you had such a brilliant season last year, what was the pressure on you been like to sort of you know, restart, get talent in, what, what's up? Yeah know, no, possible? no listen that's what we want to do, we want to get better every year so we have a big year ahead of us, we have, to, we have to improve on last year which is not going to be easy but we've got some very nice horses, I've got a great team of people working for me and I believe it's, it's you know, we're looking forward, we, it's probably the best horses we've ever had at this time of year, looking forward for the year ahead. And kind of two year olds as well, plenty of them too? We have 52 year olds, uh, a lot of new people coming along, again by design we want to build up a strong team, uh, so surely out of those 50 there's one star among them. Hopefully Johnny, best of luck, thank, thank you. you. Thanks very